Hello everyone, welcome to Detective the Motel. Now this is a demo. I am unsure if this is going to be like multiple different hotels with like different crime scenes or if it's just an entire game based around one uh, crime scene. But it seemed pretty interesting. Like I said, this is a demo. Let's hop right in and let's check it out together. Are you a real detective? Take paper and pencil because you will need them. There is no magic notebook where the things you see inside the game are automatically noted. The idea is that you yourself resolve the case by understanding what has happened. To complete the game, you must answer all the questions asked within your personal PDA. You can open it at any time. You're free to start wherever you want. Luck. Not good luck, just luck. Interact, blah, 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 blah. You use a notebook to write down what you think is important now. Is the notebook in the game or is that something I have to write down like on a pen and paper on my own? Because I mean, I do have pen and paper available to write stuff down on. I just hope that it would be in the game, but we shall see. All right, so I don't even know what the crime scene is or what's going on. I got a lot of cones. Um, it's the random ice machine. That's nothing. Okay. Do we even have like a warrant or anything? Or are we just allowed to come in these uh, rooms? Is that, is this the room we're supposed to be in? There's a paper. Irene Miller, best-selling book. This is the best day of my life. So it's May 7th, 2016. So May of 2016, we'll go ahead and write that down. Irene Miller was the most popular writer, book called Light. Okay, come from a small town north of the country. Okay, I don't think anything in that newspaper is going to be important to us. Eviction notice. We have tried to speak with you, but have not received a response. Okay, so January of 2019, it was an eviction. Okay, so 2016, she wrote a book. January 2019 eviction notice we tried to speak with you now receive the response we inform that you're going to proceed we are going to proceed to confiscate your current house we have spent weeks visiting the house in hope of being able to give him the notification personally but he is never there if you want to avoid eviction you must pay the amount of the debt as soon as possible the debt is $485 Jesus Christ. Okay, we're going to write that down because that kind of seems important. Okay, that's just... Okay, so that's just all one thing. And what's in here? Okay, not much. Not much. Nothing. Okay, any books or anything that we can look at here? Anything kind of seems out of place. Not really. Anything in the luggages? No. Okay. So this is a mo so she was living in a motel. What it seems like. I also know drawings. I'm better than her. Okay. There's a booze bottle. Looks like vodka. Okay, I don't see much of anything in here. Nothing. There is a cell phone. Let's check the cell phone. No connection. You are the only light, but you don't know it. Okay, there seems to be somebody in the bed. Looks like it's the same room with a different bedspread. I'm fed up with Anna. I can't take the noises anymore. What is she doing? I'm going to go talk to her. Don't worry. She doesn't like anyone. She won't talk to you. Okay. So, this is June 22nd. That's June 24th. You think you can lend me some money? What are you going to spend it on? Be sincere in food and some things I need. Okay, come at night, but you know, no one should see you. Okay, so we got to talk to this Carlos Rovera guy. Okay, nobody will see me, Helen Weber. Oh, these are voice messages. Hey, Helen. Edward. Hello, Edward. 
children, what's going on? Hey, Helen, I'm bored. Hello, Arun, what's going on? The voices sound very similar. I have a pretty strange neighbor. He's one of those guys obsessed with the end of the world. Today, I think he took a photo of me from his car. Really? Why don't you talk to the police? I have tried, but they say that nothing can be done with the photos. Okay, Arun, if anything happens, call me. Hey, Helen. Hello, Aaron. What's going on? Okay, Aaron. Okay, so Helen Weber is the person she was texting. Okay, Aaron. If anything happens, call me. No, we were texting Irene. Okay. Um. Okay, so we have a couple hidden numbers. Quite a few calls to Rovera. So we have a little bit of stuff on this phone here that we can deal with. I don't see anything here. Let's open up these drawers. Nothing. Nothing. Okay. Okay, nothing in the drawers. She did smoke a lot. Let's check the laptop. The pest the password is the best day of my life. That was uh January of sixteen. Hold on a second. May 7th, 2016. 5, 7, 16. Okay, so we got chapter text. Chapter 1. Um, okay, that's interesting. Dark text. I haven't written in a long time. Too long. Why can't the words come out? It's even hard for me to write these lines. Will it be his fault? It doesn't let me live. It doesn't let me be free. It doesn't let me write. If I died right now, I wouldn't care. Anna, one day you will pay for everything. I came here to change my life, find new experiences, but this motel has become a vor vertex that once inside, nothing can leave. Is anyone happy in this dark hole? If I think about it, it's been a while since I've seen anyone who doesn't live in the motel. I don't even know who's in charge of bringing the food. Okay. What is in the re so There's nothing in the recycling bin. That's there. Okay. So is So Irene Miller is who we're looking for possibly. So we got to figure out who Anna is. So are we just allowed to, like, just go in every single bedroom? Yeah, I take it every door that's open we're allowed to go in. Could you please stop accusing me of taking things from the kitchen? Thank you, I watch you. Okay. Your personal delivery man... Carlos. Carlos is a delivery man. Okay, well that helps. What's this? Locksmith, Ivy. My name is Ivy. I am an expert in storing things in the original way. I don't think that was one of the numbers in the phone. Let me go double check. I don't remember seeing the... Uh, a code being 7-2, but it could be one of the hidden numbers. 2-2, two, two. okay, so. Okay, I think that one's clear. So, Mr. Carlos is a delivery man. Let's go see what he uh, works for. Let's see if he has a company or something. If you need anything from town, anything, call me. I will only cost you a small tip. Okay. Perfect. Yeah, I don't think Ivy has anything to do with us. Okay, what's this? Notes on the last neighborhood meeting. Noises throughout the day. We all like to be quiet. I don't think anything. I'm just going to kind of just read through this a little bit. 
Um, so we've got neighbors are concerned about presence of strangers. Okay, so that might be, since uh, we saw on the phone to not be seen, that could possibly be talking about the strangers. So, let's go ahead and see what else we got here. What's on this computer? Okay. That looks like the same guy that was in the bedroom. It might be. I don't know. It looks like the same guy in that photo we saw. Okay. Is there anything else we can get out of this? No. Okay. So it looks like surveillance. Where is the camera? That'd be very helpful. Are we allowed to open these doors? No. Okay, so there's no camera here that I'm aware of that I can't can see. Do we do anything inside the vehicles? It's closed, okay. Alright, had a feeling all these were going to be locked. I don't see any other open doors. Okay, so that's not available. How do we pull up the PDA thing? Okay, so... Oh, this is uh, going to be interesting. So obviously, I don't know what room number this is. Okay, so that's definitely Irene. That's Irene Miller, room one. That I don't, none of this stuff I know yet. Okay, so we're going to go try to find some other stuff. Here. I don't have any photos of anybody except Irene. I think Irene is the one that passed away, but uh, let's go upstairs and see what we can find. There's a camera. Okay. So all of these have locks on them. Okay, I don't think I could do anything up here, but we do have a camera up here, so that might be where that video was taken from. But there's no body or anything, so that's what I'm really confused about. I wonder if this car is unlocked. I can't even go into this car. Interesting. Oh, I can't go back that way, period. What? There we go. I was, I was about to say, what's going on? <laughs> I think the game's uh, glitching a little bit. Okay, so I'm wondering if I can make phone calls on this. So it looks like June 22nd at 10 p.m. And that was a photo taken. Okay. There's nothing else 
here. Start March of 2018. And this does not have a date. Let's go see when this security footage was taken. 624-2019. So that would be 24. Be about 11. That one we don't know yet. This one, I, I don't know. I'm just going to be guessing right now if I do anything. I don't want to be guessing. So am I allowed to go in this car? No. Okay. So the eviction notice was 2019. But it doesn't tell me who gave out the eviction notice. And why was she being $485,000 in debt if she is a famous author that's the part that the, isn't making any sense to me but then again people do spend money I also know drawings I'm better than her I don't know what that means Nothing in any of these drawers. There's a knife. No, nope, that's not a knife. Because he came out of that room, went over there, and then two minutes later, went back into this room right here. Which I think is this room. Is there like a manager at this motel or someone I can talk to? So that's not available. This looks like the room that he could be in. Because the camera would be... There is no camera. Interesting. And I can't go into here. I can't go into the rooms upstairs. I don't really have much to go off of. We're just going to assume this right here is Alex Brown. No, that can't be right. I'm gonna go and say that this is... Ivy Brown. This is Carlos. Irene, Alex... This is Anna. That's... No, that, that's going to be uh, Ivy. This is going to be Anna. That's Carlos. And this is Abner.
I'm gonna go... I'm just gonna submit, see what we get. He's room four, two, two, zero. It doesn't say how many I got correct, so I don't know what the actual uh, thing is. Everything is filled out. Yeah, I don't know, guys. I went through all the evidence that we can. I mean, obviously, this is a demo, so you're not going to get everything. But uh, it's not letting me do anything with the uh, correct answers. Um, Yeah, I don't know. I've pretty much gone through all of the evidence that we can. And I've come up with nothing. I just came up with uh, possibly Irene Miller is dead. Carlos Rivera is a delivery man. Could have hid her body. There is a video showing a random male going out of one room into another and then back to the other room, which could be off of that security camera right there, because that looks to be the only security camera there is. Um, Irene Miller's possibly dead. Anna hates her, and we do have a delivery driver. I don't know about anybody else, and that's all I've pretty much got. So... I think that's going to end the episode here. I mean, it's kind of not a, uh, I don't know. Maybe I'm missing something or maybe my game's just bugging, but yeah, I don't know what else to look at or anything. There's nothing else really to, uh, go off of. So, but yeah, guys, that is going to go ahead and do it for this one. Hopefully you guys enjoyed and I'll catch you here on the next video. Take care, everyone.